there everybody, Donnie Rosie at Miracle Mountain Ranch and we are enjoying a spring-like day. It was up in the 40s yesterday, high 30s today and I tell you what, that feels amazing. Let's just look around just a little bit. You can actually see some, I don't know if you can call it dry ground, but at least you can see the ground. And that brings us to an interesting season here at Miracle Mountain Ranch and that's where local people start to make maple syrup. So I wanted to show you that happening a little bit and then also show you again some more progress on that bunkhouse as we keep taking steps forward. I want you to meet one of our youngest staff members. Hi Tessa, can you say hi? Enjoying a little of the spring weather we had today. Being attacked. Here's my boys. What are you guys doing right now? This is quite the snow pile you got here. You can see Nathan up there on the tractor. He's moving all this slush and snow out of the way because what happens when it warms up like this, you get this slush and it's very hard to drive on. So he's great with the tractor and making a lot of progress on trying to get everything plowed. Here's the latest on the bunkhouse. You see a lot of the insulation is done. A lot of the ceiling is done here. Chip's working over here on some floor pieces that need to come out and reinforce. And then you can see these boards here. These are two by eights laid out so they can be cut to the right length and placed. We have reinforced the floor with some sauna tubes, cement there. And so this is really coming together. And Doug Widener, who's helping us a little bit, saying that uh, he should be able to start putting down some of the sheeting uh, come tomorrow, hopefully. So that's the latest on the bunkhouse, and we'll keep you up to date. Again, if you're interested in coming to volunteer, get a hold of Mark Carpenter. We'd love to have you come up and, and help out with some of these projects, especially as we get towards the spring. See if we can carry one in and uh, film at the same time. So you can see there's a lot going on at Miracle Mountain Ranch. There's these things that you see and behind the scenes there's students in our school discipleship program that are learning the Bible and learn to share and teach others. There's caring for the animals. There's always stuff going on here and we're, we're looking forward to season of ministry as we come into the, the late winter and spring. So you can keep us in your prayers and we'd love to see you if you get a chance to come out. I believe there's Nathan on the tractor and he's going around and collecting this up. Here we are down at some maple trees that Nathan Snyder has tapped and uh, it's going pretty well. You can see the lines running from tree to tree. This one's tapped kind of up high and the sap runs from here into these tubes down and then into the tank that Nathan's actually down there emptying. And then he produces some of this and sells it and sells some of it in the store and we're able to give away some as well. All right, so Nathan, explain the, the process we got going on here. And you said uh, today was a, a really good day for the maple syrup, uh, the maple sap running? It was better than I thought it would be, yeah. It was up, got up around 36, 38 degrees. And um, as you can see, we got quite a bit of little, little sap here. So we're gonna put it in this tank, then I'm gonna take it up to um, where I'm gonna RO it. And, um, at some point this week, I'll work on getting it down and then boiling it out into syrup. And you make this available in the store and uh, personally as well, right? That's correct, yep. So if somebody wants some maple syrup from Miracle Mountain Ranch or from, from you on Miracle Mountain Ranch, they can uh, come up sometime. That's correct. Fun. So does it flow out as maple syrup? No. It comes out at about 2% sugar and syrup is about 68% sugar. So about how many gallons do you have to take 
of sap down to get that syrup? Um, usually about 40, 40 to 45 gallons of sap for one gallon of syrup. Fun. Well, maybe we'll visit you at your shack and see some of the uh, boiling process later. That'd be great. Hi, Hannah. This is one of our other little junior staff members. So there's a little update of what's going on here today at Miracle Mountain Ranch.